Hello everybody, I started a new Minecraft world today. Yeah. Look at this place. We have just spawned in in the water for some reason. In the middle of a desert. You all can clearly see this. But still I am going to explain you all that we are in the middle of a desert and I know how to stay alive and blah 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 that stuff. Let's try hunting these for some food maybe we can get yeah we can get these dead bushes at least we can we have some sticks because there are no trees in sight you can see it's like all around uh, once it uh, goes all the way up on the mountain i show you all around this place just to show you all this that there's no tree even close from here like i cannot even see one so I don't know how would I explain this thing to you all. Let's keep on going up on the mountain. You all can see we are just stuck in a maze biome. Which is more like an endless biome. Because look at this. This whole place is like just a deserted place. Oh there is water but no trees so it's bad for me. No trees, no oxygen here. We are going to suffocate in this place. And yeah, you know what? This world is going to be deleted too, like other worlds, because you know, I don't really play survival that much. The reason why I'm doing this all and trying to survive is how to get better, to get better at survival. Well, I thought I'm playing Skyblocks. I thought I was, I'm way too good at survival. I can survive in time, anyway, in this Minecraft world. This was all the thing I was thinking about, and yeah, this is how I ended up in here. Let's keep on going up in this place. We will just find a village with some saplings to get the wood. So that's the only place where I can get some wood. Otherwise, all I can get is these sticks, and you cannot craft blocks from sticks. Where is that a spider? Okay, you will attack me because most spiders don't attack during daytime, but this one does. Run as fast as you can go because the spider will get you before you know. This is why you have to learn. You have to learn. Not for making the learn for our life, and yeah. Look at this coral leaves. This place looks beautiful, kind of colorful, and all. But hey, look at these. These are like some dead corals and regular corals. There are lots of these, so it's nice. Let's try getting some food. Maybe we can hit these fishes. Hunting for fishes is really hard, actually. Because we cannot ha attack them proper. Like, even though I'm trying to hit them, but I cannot hit them because. They yeah, are so fast in water and I cannot move properly, I don't even have a proper weapon to fight with. That's the only reason why I'm doing this. This is why I'm doing this. Surviving in Minecraft is a great trick because you know, you never know how and how the life may end up for you. I'm trying to survive in Minecraft world was what I was thinking to do. Just because I want to make a proper survival world, and this is a trial of survival actually. And if I pass in this thing, I'll make a survival series. Proper series, not just a world, but a series of survival videos. If I somehow manage to survive the first night of this world, because there are no sheep, because it's desert, no any other thing, because it is like middle of ocean. And desert. This is all we have. No azalea trees so that we can find a lush cave underneath. Nah, nothing like that. Like this world is kind of bad, or maybe the just the spawn is bad. I try using a seed for the survival world, maybe. And now we don't even have the ability to swim. We have to move it like this all around the whole ocean, which is kind of unfortunate for for us. Yes, it is kind of bad, but still we have to survive this because this is all the game is about. So let's take a moment to survive this place because I know where I'm going to be. 
And in some way, really badly. Bad survival, never tried surviving. Even one night, so you know what is going to happen is. It is going to be kind of really bad because, because I never tried survival, but I see a piece of land. I saw a piece of heaven waiting in the patience of the dog. This is the piece of heaven I, we have been talking about. Look at that, we found some ground. Maybe we will find some chickens on it, please. If there are any, then that would be really nice. But I don't think so. So all we are going to do is go on the island, try finding something. If it does, that's nice. But if we don't, I don't know what we are going to do. All we are going to do is drown in this place. Because I am bad survival. My first night. I don't even have any food left. Like we are going to starve after all. If we don't drown, we are going to starve. So we don't have any other joys else than time in this place. Ha ha ha. Are there any rounds I can hunt for? Just for some food. I don't think there are any more to be hunted. Like look at this whole place. It's like okay, let's try hunting these fishes. Hello, can I hit you? Okay, I can I can they are running so fast. I would say they are running super fast, okay. They are down, they are down. They can hit you, they can hit you actually. Which is a nice thing to know. But they are not able to hit me right now. For some reasons. Which I don't know why it is happening, but still they can hit you, which is nice. Some reason rounds are not attacking me. I don't know what happened, my game just glitched and boom. Yeah, no, okay, okay, they hit me, they hit me just after I hit them. They hit me so hard, like we died. And now let's get some more sticks for no reason. Like seriously, we cannot even craft anything with these. So it's the worst spawn ever we can have thought of, but yeah, it is a spawn and there is nothing close to this place. Like, look at this place. That sounds like the worst spawn ever on this world. I'm going to go in creative in this world in the tomorrow's video and check out this place later. Because maybe we'll find something when we are able to fly. Maybe something very, very rare. And once I find anything good, I'll just make this new world with the same seeds. Boom. And start a new world. Just to survive the first night. You know. Okay. They say surviving the first night is the hardest thing. Try it in bad truck edition. If you get a, this bad spawn, you'll never be able to survive even half a night. Actually. So, as you all can see, we are in the middle of nowhere for now. You can clearly see we are in the middle of nowhere. Uh, we have cactus, 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 and even more cactus. Cacti, 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 whatever you call this thing. But all we have is this and a huge endless desert. Like for desert, we have desert. <laughs> no, I think this is a cave. No, this is just a little bit of hole, I like, think. Eh? Nothing special in it. <laughs> it's just bad because I want a special place. I want to see it if you would. Can you please? You all can do a favor of commenting down a good seed for the start of survival world and not this bad. No trees in a range, like nowhere any trees. So this is going to be a really bad start and trying of survival one night in this place with hard difficulty. I don't think this is even possible for a human to do. Okay, we are on half a heart somehow managed to survive this fall. I thought I would die and just reach at the fall spawn easily. But no. Yeah. That will never happen. Okay, no, don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me. No, no, I don't have enough time for this all games. And okay, then I keep on running, keep on running. 
Well, yes, right now running for our lives, and somehow if you lose many, he used to survive all these mobs, and not die here because a single hit will just end my game for now. We'll be demolished after. Okay, I thought there was a baby zombie, but this was just too dead precious. Okay, let's swim away from this place because giants may attack us because it's night, and eventually we end the auto. So maybe the giants will attack us, but it's, they are not going to do it this early. So. All we can do is just run for rush run out from this place and try to survive like somewhere else. Okay, we can see see an island and it is made up of sand. I can clearly see this. Because this is a huge desert area. I don't know how <laughs> how big is this place. But I can say one thing for sure that it is it's an endless desert. And this desert is not ending anytime soon. Let's jump over in this place and I think there are no mobs here. It's nice to meet you know there are so, so many of those and there are some zombies over there. Run away, run away, we have to run away as fast as we could. And now we are in the water across this little lake. Oh no, we don't want to cross this lake. We are just going away from this place as fast as we could. And as far as we could go. Now we have to somehow survive this first night. And surviving this is the hardest part according to some people. And with this type of spawn like completely surrounded by a coral reefs and desert. I don't think it is even possible to find a shipwreck in this place. Because shipping doesn't spawn in coral reefs. <laughs> it's kinda unfortunate spawn, but hey. Yeah. We will try our best to somehow, somehow, somehow survive in this world. Okay, we cannot even swim in this place. Like seriously, we don't even have the ability to swim and we are shot by a trident. Bye!